going to learn how to create some more tidy tabs here in our bookmarks bar for the Google Chrome. So uh, here we are. I've logged in onto my Google Chrome browser. Um, I have my email logged in attached to it. And I have many favorites here. So many of us have favorites that are just kind of all over the place. You might even have so many favorites that um, it kind of spills over. So let's make an example here. So I added another, maybe even here we go, new tab. So many tabs that you might even have an arrow that has a list of the many favorites and, and bookmarks you have. So to get a little more organized, we're going to learn how to create folders and how to even just leave some of the icons present without any text. So this system works well if you have icons that are displayed that you can easily identify or remember as to what they're for. So I have my class dojo, Zoom, Schoology. All of these I know exactly what they are just by looking at the icon. It might not work so well with icons that kind of are repetitive or don't really give you a clue as to what it is. So these work well with um, these specific types of bookmarks. Uh, but we can also organize in a different way aside from doing this by making folders. So we'll initially start um, by creating these icons only. So I'll use the example of my benchmark universe. So I'm going to click here. And I have my favorite. So initially when you save it might uh, say benchmark universe or whatever you're saving. And it will probably look like this. So to remove these words, you can either, if you're already on that page, click the star and remove the text from here, or you can hover over your bookmark, control and click on your trackpad, or right click on your mouse, and you can click edit. And we're just going to delete all, those, all that highlighted text, and there you go, you're left with just the icon. So now moving on to creating folders. So um, to help organize the many tabs we have, you might want to create a folder and label it and add many of your saved uh, bookmarks into that folder. So for example, I have a teacher resources folder with many things in here. I even have a separate folder with even more resources. So to create a folder, you can hover in between any of your bookmarks or you can come to the end of your bookmark bar and click control and click on your trackpad or click uh, the right side of your mouse and scroll down to add a folder. You can name your folder whatever you like. I'm just going to name it example folder and press save. Um, if you notice it asked you where you wanted to save your folder so I'll do that one more time going to click between two favorites, add a folder, and I did do a right click or a control click on my trackpad. So you can save it to the bookmarks bar or other bookmarks. I'm going to just go with bookmarks bar because that's where I want it and you would press save. So if you've made extra folders and now you're deciding, oh, I didn't need that many, you can also click control and on your, click on your trackpad or your right click and scroll down to delete as well. So every time you create a new folder or a new uh, favorite bookmark, it will uh, automatically be at the end of your list. So to move it to another space, you can hover over it, click, hold and drag, and let go as to wherever you would like to have it. So because that was more of a sample, I'm just going to delete it. Um, you can also drag a folder. I'll do the example of my BAPA folder. I'll bring it back out. 
so I click and drag. If you're interested in moving a folder inside of another one, you can click and drag and place it inside another folder and let go wherever you see fit. So there we have it and all your um, bookmarks are a little more tidy now. So I hope this helps you in creating a more tidy space visually on your uh, Chrome browser area here. All right, thank you for watching. And if you enjoyed this video and it helped you, please like and subscribe so I know to continue making videos just like these. Thank you. See you next time.